How are you guys doing, Eric here? Today is Saturday, September 24th, 2016. Beautiful morning up here in Gilpin County. This is the peak weekend for the for the aspen changing. It's, it's cooling off too, and summer is definitely over with. It's like 25 degrees up here this morning. Chilly! Feels nice though. Beautiful sunny morning here. And it's been an interesting week, to say the least. All this shit going on. What have we had this week? Fucking terror attacks, police shootings, fucking riots. Peaceful protests. Can Bill Clinton, I mean Hillary Clinton, Donald Trump. It's just been a plethora of freaking shit this week. <laughs> a fucking fake ass bombing over there in New York. Another one, right? No one was killed. This is like another pressure cooker bomber, right? Just like fucking Boston bombing fucking hoax. So, of course, right, as soon as it happened, right, a thousand fucking more cops on the streets in New York, man. They're really turning it into a fucking police state there. It's becoming fucking total lockdown, Nazi Germany fucking style. Yep, that's the idea, right? Oh, fuck. It's, it's getting bad, man. Looking. They will know, call it martial law, though. It's going to be... A state of emergency. We gotta keep people safe from our fake fucking terror attacks. You know? But yeah. And then they were talking, and then another interesting thing that I thought Donald Trump said in an interview, he was asked. What do you think we what, what do you think would be the best thing we could do to keep America safe? And he said, "Of course, you know I think we need, we need to we need to implement stop and frisk nationwide. It'll be fabulous. You, you're gonna love it. We we had we had stop and frisk here in New York, and, and it was fabulous. The people loved it. It was incredible. So, yeah, I think I think the people are gonna love it. The people of New York loved it." You're gonna love to be stopped and frisked, and you're gonna be kept safe. <laughs> I couldn't believe it, man. You know, these two fucking, this presidential fucking campaign is so ridiculous, man. It's a total shit show, totally fucking staged and fucking scripted. I mean, what a joke it is. All they, all they keep, all you keep hearing from the fucking spin doctors and media and the fucking chickens running around with their heads cut off, freaking out about everything, that neither one of these two fucking turds are electable. <laughs> How do we get here? We got these two fucking pieces of shit. <laughs> Nobody wants to vote for either one of them. It's fucking hilarious. Well, now there's, there's quite a few Trump supporters out there. You know, How the fuck can you... Can you fucking comes right out and says he wants to implement stop and frisk nationwide. Not that the president has that power, but I don't know. The president pretty much has the power to do anything he wants in this country, man. The executive order is the only way anything gets done anymore in our government. It's all done by executive order and fucking the goddamn Supreme Court fucking punks. <clears throat> They're all in lockstep with stealing our fucking rights and putting us uh, who knows but it's definitely not good for us <laughs> so yeah man that's what's going on this week man it's just beautiful here now man the wind quit blowing sun's coming out it's gonna be a fucking nice day up here Cool, warming up quick. 
And yeah, and then, the, then the, the bomber, right? The guy that, I think it was like two days after the bombing, they, they found him sleeping in a, like a vestibule of a bar. And the guy called the cop, I guess. So I think, I think it was in New Jersey. And there was a shootout. This guy had a shootout with the police. He shot four cops and was wounded in the arm. And they took him into custody. Now he's, he's still in the hospital recovering. Fucking bullshit, man. I ain't buying it. <laughs> if you just look at that story right now, right there, that tells you the whole thing is a fucking set up piece of shit, man. You don't get in the shootout with four cops, shoot four cops, and live to tell about it, man. I'm sorry, it just ain't gonna happen. That's a fucking fairy tale, man. I expect us to believe that shit. God. It's like in your face, we're fucking boss fucking lying to you, man. And bald face fucking lies. We were supposed to believe it. Shoot out with four cops and lives to tell about it. Just thought I had to add that. Uh, look at these trees. With the sun hitting them. Very beautiful. Wow, look at all the yellow leaves on the ground. It looks like a carpet of color. All right, I made it to the top. Top of the world looking down on creation. Look at that tree. And there is the Great Continental Divide. Uh, look at all the color. Color. So colorful. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys soon.